Tonight's next question comes to us from David in Fort Collins. He noticed some odd ramp-like structures along the hairpin turns of Berthoud Pass. So David sent us a GIF of what he was looking at. You see it there along the road, kind of like that little dugout thing. Almost looks like you, you drive down into a tunnel there. CDOT tells us those are catch basins and they're there to protect water quality. When sediment comes down the mountain, it's supposed to wind up in those basins instead of going into streams and lakes. It keeps the traction sand that goes onto the roads during bad weather from going into the water system as well. So the idea is to protect the fish habitat, protect wetlands. The basins will also temporarily store snow melt and stormwater runoff. The, settle, the sediment can settle to the bottom of the catch basins. The water kind of trickles out and it's cleaner than if it had all that stuff in there. CDOT will come through and clear out the sediment from time to time. CDOT says when the pass was updated in the late 90s, early 2000s, the Hoop Creek watershed, tributary of Clear Creek, was having a real issue with traction sand. So to deal with that, they put 12 of those catch basins along US 40 on Berthoud Pass. There are also some installed along I-70 from the tunnels, down to Floyd Hill. Sorry, no alien base under the mountain. Send us your questions, big or small. Record them on video or audio if you would, or send us a gift like David did and email it to next at 9news.com. We'll sift through the sediment and get you an answer.